squirrel. He's running. There's two of them. They're running in the yard right there. They're, they they were under your truck. Oh. They just well, ran under your truck. Crazy. Let's go get a geocache. Okay. All right. We'll go climb a we'll go climb a tree like a squirrel. Okay. You'll climb a tree like a squirrel. I'm too old. Bro, do you see that park truck I went around the curb? Do you see that I went around the I went like this and turned in. That's crazy right there. That's crazy. That's crazy. Hey, welcome to fall. Do you, we're gonna go do some fall geocaching. Go see if we can find ourselves a geocache in a tree. And see if I can get him to be like a squirrel. Hey, should I put it on the on this bridge? What do you think? No. What? No. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I'll I don't think I'll be putting on this bridge here and falling in the muddy waters there. <laughs> You're filming. I'm filming now. Filming. Tell us the heart shaped leaf. <laughs> yeah, I used to go fishing way over on the other side over there. That's where all the bass were. Many, many people come fishing down here. They go fishing for the, uh, the trout that they plant in this lake. It wasn't always a lake though. At one time, it was a gravel pit. Then what the rumor is, is they were doing their ex excavation work. They hit a spring and it filled up. That's the rumor. I don't know if it's true or not, but that's what I heard. And then if you watch one of my other videos, um, the one with the big bus or train or whatever the heck it was, that was from this place here. We're not gonna go the easy way. We're gonna go this way. The cash is that way. That's where we're going. Okay, see you later. What? Oh, looks like we're gonna have to duck under this. Yo, I think that's it right there. All right, let's go. Oh, I don't, I wouldn't come up here. Holy. Oh, oh, Lee, you feel late. Oh, Lee. Oh, you got look down there. Oh. Okay. It's gotta be like right here. Oh man. What? You see it? No. What if that tree fell right? What if you're climbing it and it falls right into the lake? What if I fall in the lake? Oh man. <laughs> oh man. Okay. How far up there is it? Okay. No, don't climb it, please. Please don't. Yo, that doesn't, that's not a good idea. I wouldn't do that. Oh. Okay. Got it. Who's hanging? Right up there. Well, it's this log. Oh man, I could pitch all over my hands. Good thing you're not driving. But I got a doll, I got a duck. Duck, it's a duck. All right, same log. All right, you guys, just got my, whoa, blackberries. Just got myself a three and a half Three and a half geocache. Right in this tree right here. 
I don't know how safe it is. Maybe it should be like a five difficulty or a train, five train, because I mean like right next to the tree is like this cliff down to the water. The tree itself is like, it's like leaning. It's like leaning into, it's like leaning down this cliff. I don't know, this cliff is like, I don't know, what do you think? Maybe 150 feet? No, like, I don't 50 know, feet. 50? 50, 75 feet high down to the water there? Oh man, okay. But hey, we pulled it off. Got an awesome view, an awesome lake right over here. Just, oh, here's a little story. So this right here is Salmon Creek right here. Salmon Creek used to run along and over on that other side of the berm there, or the dike, um, is where the creek used to run. And then we had this major flooding. This whole thing flooded out and then it created a whole new way through this, and well, it created a whole new path. And it created this, this new lake right here. So now it cuts through this lake and then back into the creek again. So I tell you, we have no power over the environment. It just does whatever it wants to do. Anyway, make sure you subscribe and I'll see you on our next adventure. Yo, what should they do? Like, share, and subscribe. Yeah, guys, we'll catch you later.